Hi, this is Nellie Deutsch, and today I'm going to show you how to create a badge, a digital badge in a Moodle course. So I'm in a course called Community of Educators, and I'm going to start a new badge. First of all, you need to give it a title and a description. Next, you'll add your badge. Now, I create my badges on Canva, which is completely free, and I've been using it for years. So the name of the badge is Face-to-Face -face versus Online Instruction and Learning. This is a discussion, and it's required. Next, I'm going to go into Upload Profile, Upload Image here. You can also drag it over here, so um, I can do that as well. Notice the file picker over here. There are a few options under file picker. You can upload, which is what I just did. You can also go to your Google Drive. You can add a URL downloader if you have the link to an image Dropbox, Wikipedia, Box, Microsoft OneDrive if you use Microsoft, or Flickr. If you use a Flickr, you can also go into the content bank and create it there. Now notice next is to upload. You've got to upload or you're not going to be able to view it. So you can see that it's here. If you see it there, it means that you can continue. So let me go on. Notice these are the various files that can be added. You can then add your name, your email, your image, author's URL, and so on. All these details may be relevant. Now notice all these badges are coded, which means that even if someone saves it as, they're not going to get the original. The original is coded and it's straight from the Moodle. So notice you can also have a fixed date if you wish, or I usually do never, and then you click on Create. You're bad. Lots of information here. Take a look at it. See what's relevant to you. Now notice this badge already exists, so I need to give it another name. So I can call it something else. Uh, let me just uh, Instruction and leave out the learning. Okay, the badge is still there, notice. All right, so let me continue here, create the badge. Notice you get the orange, or you might get a different color depending on your theme. I'm using Edweiser Rem UI, and this is Moodle 3.10. So in order to get rid of that and turn it into green, you need to add criteria. And notice you can choose your badge criteria, which is a requirement. Now, I usually choose manual as well as um, activities. So manual, just in case uh, something goes wrong and the person does their work, but it doesn't go in properly. It can also be based on course completion, awarded badges, and uh, competencies. Of course, I'm going to use activity. In this case, now there are two activities. All the activities will appear if you've given or you've added conditions to them. Otherwise, they won't appear. So notice, get acquainted and uh, this form. So I'm going to use this form. Click on it. Notice you can also enable a date completed by if you've got strict regulations, which I don't. And next, you can make, if you have a few, a list of criteria, if you want both of them or just one, you can decide all of the selected or any. Okay, next, you're going to maybe add a description if you like. And finally, save it. I'm going to go to the Save button. And notice uh, right now, we're almost done. Next step is to enable it. Now, if the course hasn't started, they won't be able to get their badges until the course starts. But since this course started, notice the next step is to confirm. Click on Continue. And now it's green and everything is all set. It's below and subscribe to my channel. Join Moodle for Teachers for free professional development and to try out various tools. Thank you for watching and have a wonderful day.